is a tough assignment for any team at the moment. Aston Villa have won a club record 11 successive home Premier League games and now look to stretch that sequence against Luton Town, who will be encouraged by the point they took from their visit to Nottingham Forest. Going up to our, our pre-match meal and pressing the button and it went, you are going up. And I was like, yeah, that's about right. We're seeing a picture of names and green as a team and individually. Really, make some noise for Jed Steer. Yeah. Aston Villa, who've shown they can cope with the demands of the Premier League and the UEFA Europa Conference League, and who return to Villa Park now to take on Luton Town. Luna Emery marks his first year in charge with his team trying to extend a club record run of 11 successive home Premier League wins. Villa are on fire. Kaminsky with plenty of company inside his six-yard area. McGinn. And John McGinn scores. Luton static. It's a well-worked free-kick routine. And John McGinn, who thought about having a go with his left, took it with his right. And Villa in front. 17 minutes played. again whipped in by Dean Bailey couldn't get that but the RB could emphatic finish brilliant ball in by Dean and a super finish by the RB 2-0 
It's been put in by Lockyer. Further world for Luton. Diaby with the run that caused the problems after the long ball over the top. Panzu Townsend managed to dig out the cross. Any bio off the bar and in an own goal at the other end. <laughs> Comfortable for an I am Ray and Aston Villa after what has been an excellent week. A year in charge, 12 straight home Premier League successes, and this one is finished. Aston Villa 3, Luton Town 1.